minutes of cardio and 10 minutes of strength. We're going to start with a dynamic warm-up. Take the feet outside of the hips nice and wide and reach the hands for the feet. Push the hips high, straighten the legs. You want to turn on the hamstrings here. Feel the back of the legs wake up. Tuck the chin and look behind you. Slowly point the toes out, bend the knees, and sit the hips nice and low. We're going to take a second to open up through the hips. I want the whole foot to be on the ground flat. I don't want you up on your tiptoes. So however you need to adjust your position to get those feet flat, sit into the heels, and then let's press the elbows to the insides of the knees by pressing the palms together. Drive the elbows into the knees and open up the hips a little bit more. Good. Let's take the left hand down and take the right hand high to find a twist. So let's open up through the chest and wake up that spine. Stretching, part of stretching is mobility, finding movement, opening up through the muscles, through the joints, and finding space. Good. Take the right hand down, take the left hand high, reach it up, and then pull it back to open the chest. Good. Bring it down. Let's shoot the hips high, straighten the legs. And point the toes forward and then slowly, one vertebrae at a time, roll up to stand. Bring the shoulders up, back, and down. Good. Let's step the feet right underneath the hips. We're going to take ourselves into some lunges out to the side. Step out wide, push the hips back, and bend one leg. We're going to stretch out and lengthen that inner thigh. And we're going to sit in to that hip. Push the hip back, sit into that lunge, and stay here for just a second. Mobility, stretching. Perfect to do right before your workout and right after. We're gonna step in and then step to the other side. Find that lunge. Push the hips back, sit into that hip, and lengthen out through the inner thigh to wake it up. Stay here for just a second. Good, step it in. We're gonna do one more on each side, and we're gonna add a reach. Find your lunge. And then point the fingers towards the floor and raise the arms up slowly by the ear. This is going to activate our shoulders and our core. Hold it here. Sit into that lunge and then step it to center. We have one more going the other side. Find that lunge. Sit the hips back. Point the fingers down and then raise the arms up by the ears. Hold it here. Sit lower into that lunge. Good. Step it to center, take it to the back or the top of your mat. We're going to work to a plank, walk out, forward fold. Bend the knees if you need to to connect the hands to the mat. We're going to walk the hands out to a plank. Hold your plank here for just a second. I want you to sink the shoulder blades together, like you're going to touch the edges of your shoulder blades together. Good, then push away. Rounding the upper back and pulling the shoulder blades apart. Good. Bend the knees and walk the hands in. And let's take a slow roll to the top. Nice and slow. Once you get to the top, we're going to take a shoulder roll up, back, and down. Good. We've got some hip stretching and opening up by lifting that left knee high. Now, don't let that left foot droop down towards the floor. You want that left toe to pull up towards the ceiling. Find your balance, squeeze your core. And then take the left hip out to the side, take it around to the back, and drop that left foot down. To find yourself in a lunge by bending that back knee down. You'll feel a nice stretch through the front of the hip. We're gonna turn to the right. Hold it here. Good, let's step it in. Other side, you're going to take your right knee high and hold. Squeeze the core. Find balance. It's okay if you fall over. Don't fall on the ground, please. Just reset if you feel like you need to bring that right foot down. Pull the right foot up towards the knee. And when you're ready, you'll take that right knee out to the side, around the back. Drop it down to the floor and take that knee down for the lunge. Hold it here, and then we're going to twist to the left. Nice stretch on the front of the hip. Good, step it in. We got one more on each side. Left knee high and hold. Take it out, around to the back. 
Find your lunge and twist to the right. Good, step it in. Last one. Right knee high and hold. Right knee out to the side. Open up that hip, around to the back. Find your lunge and twist to the left. Good, step it in and shake it out. That was half of our stretching. We'll get the other five minutes of stretching at the end of class for cool down. We're gonna jump into our cardio. Give me a jump rope. 10 minutes of cardio, 10 minutes of strength, and 10 minutes of stretching. We're gonna take it to a lateral high knee skip. Let's go, drive the knee high and move from one side of the mat to the other in a big skip, pull the knee up. Once you reach the end of your mat, you're gonna to go to the opposite side. Driving the knee. Good, now give me a jumping jack. You wanna get that heart rate up. If you cannot jump, you can step and reach. It works. For three, two, one, give me a heel kick. Now, high impact is here. If you've got that, great. If not, you can slow it down by just kicking the heel without the jump. Back to the jump rope. Let's go, we got two more rounds just like that. 15 seconds in each move, and then we'll switch it up. In three, two, one, we have that high knee skip from one side of the mat to the other. Now the arms should be swinging from cheek to cheek. Big arm swings, bending at the elbow. Three, two, one, we have that jumping jack. Again, high impact or low, totally up to you. Do what feels right for your body. For three, two, one, we have the heel kick. You can jog it out or you can just kick the leg. For five seconds, three, two, one, back to that jump rope. Last round. We've got that lateral skip. In five seconds, four, three, two, one, take the skip. Popping off of the toe and driving the opposite knee high. Five seconds, we go to jumping jack, two, one, jump or step, up to you. Five seconds. We go to those heel kicks. Let's go. Low impact or high. Whatever feels good. Kick that heel high to the glutes. Five seconds. Three, two, one. Shake the legs out and grab a quick drink. That was the start of our cardio. The next part of cardio, we have three moves. 45 seconds of each move, 15 seconds off. We're going two rounds. We're gonna start in 15 seconds with a sprinter. Now a sprinter, we're gonna reach our left leg back, our left leg back and our left arm front. The sprinter is here, where you give a little pop forward, or you drive the knee. We're going 45 seconds on each side. Take that left leg back, left arm goes forward. In three, two, one, you're gonna swing the arms to the center, and then find yourself back in that starting position. You don't need to do a bunch of these. Hold the position and stick before you start. Now you can just drive the knee or you can jump it up. Whatever feels right for you. We're halfway there, we got 20 seconds. Swing the arms big. Keep the arms long and keep a lean 
over that right leg. We've got 10 seconds to start to feel that hip tell you it is awake and working. And shake out the legs. We have 15 seconds before we start with the right leg. Lengthen and then give it a little plyometric hop. We're going in five seconds. Right leg back, right arm forward, and let's go. You're gonna pop up, driving that knee, or you're just going to drive the knee high and restart. You can pop or not, up to you. Arms stay long. Halfway there, we have 20 seconds. Squeeze your core. If you ever feel like you're gonna fall over. We have five seconds. Three, two, one, and relax. Shake out the legs. We jumped up. Now we're gonna jump to the side. We have skaters, 45 seconds in three, two, one, let's go. Skate from side to side. Find a rhythm, hopping from one side of your mat to the other. And if you can, keep the leg in the back up off the floor. Try to stick your position Stick your landing before you go to the other side. Now you can just find a smooth rhythm that feels good and keep moving. If the hop doesn't work for you, step and reach. Just keep moving. Three, two, and one. Take a breather. 15 seconds. We have a forward bound single leg. We're gonna go jump up into the right with the right, land on the right. We're gonna jump up into the left with the left, landing on the left. 45 seconds. In five, in three, two, one, let's go. Jump up, use your right leg to hold that landing, find your balance. And then back to the start and go to the left side. Hold your landing each time. It's about balance. That foot lands flat. Squeeze your core to help stick the landing. 15 seconds. You're jumping forward and to the side. And then back pedaling. Five seconds. All right, relax. 15 seconds. Nice job. We have one more round. Sprinters, skaters, forward bounce. Three. Actually, let's wait a second. Let's take a 30 second in between each round, just to catch our breath. Cardio doesn't mean we have to exhaust. Let's go in three, two, one, sprinter. That left leg goes back, left arm comes forward. Swing the arms and drive that left knee. The right foot is doing all that work, holding the weight. The right knee stays behind the right toe. Everything is lengthened and then everything comes into center together. We're more than halfway there. We have 15 seconds. Five seconds. You got it. Three, two, one. And take that 15 second break. Catch your breath. We're gonna go from the right leg next. Five seconds, three, two, one, right leg back, 
Right arm forward, lengthen and drive. Find that starting position. And then drive that knee, pressing off of that left foot. Halfway there. Last round, best round. Squeeze your core. Less than 10 seconds. Three, two, one, and relax. Whew. Grab a drink if you need it. We have 15 seconds <clears throat> before we move to skaters. In three, two, one, let's skate side to side. It can be a hop, it can be a step. You can keep them close together, or you can go as far from one side to the other as you can. More than halfway there. We have 20 seconds. You got it. Less than 10. Three, two, and one. Take a break. Grab some water, we have 15 seconds. We have forward bound, and then we'll take a longer break. Take deep breaths. Meet me at the back of your mat. We're alternating these single leg forward bounds in three, two, one. Let's go. Jump up and to the left with that left foot at your stance leg. Hold that landing. Squeeze your core and then back pedal to start. We're more than halfway there. We've got about 15 seconds. We got five, three, two, and one. Take a break. Nice job. Grab some water. That is our cardio. Whew. We have strength coming up. For the strength portion today, we're gonna to do a ladder. We've got five moves. The first round, we're gonna do one of everything. And then the next round will be two of everything, all the way up to five. Once we hit five, we'll come down to four, three, two, one. We'll finish that ladder for our strength portion today, and then we'll stretch it out. Just another couple of seconds to catch your breath. We have a walkout, just like in our warm up, but we're going to do a push up. Now, as those progress, we'll hold that walkout and do one push up. The second time, we'll do two push ups. We're not going to walk it out every time we do a push up. We have a Superman. We'll lay on our back, on our tummy. We'll lift, squeezing our back, and we'll pull our arms back to a W. We have a squat hold, a sumo squat hold, wide stance, hips go down and low, we hold one count all the way up to five. We have a reverse lunge pulse. We'll do a reverse lunge just like in our warm up. We'll pulse for one on each side all the way up to five. We have a plank, a shoulder tap on each arm, and then we'll start over with two of everything. If you guys are ready, make your way to your mat. We've got the walkout push up for one. Find yourself in a fold, walk it out. Knees or toes, find your push up and then walk it in. Take it down to the knees, all the way down to your belly. Find yourself with the arms out in front, 
And then lift into a Superman and pull the elbows back towards your sides for that W. You're going to take it to the top. We have a squat hold. Feet so go wide. Drop the hips low into your squat hold for one. Step it up. We have a reverse lunge on the right. Find a pulse for one. Step it in. Left leg goes back. Pulse for one. Step it in. We have planks with a shoulder tap before we go to the top. Bring it down to your plank. Knees or toes up to you. You're gonna tap opposite hand, opposite shoulder one time. Bring it back to your feet. To the top, we have two of everything. Forward fold, walk it out. You have two push-ups, knees or toes up to you. After that second push-up, lower down, find your Superman, pull the arms back for a W, and then release. Again, for number two, lift and pull. Good, take it to the top. We've got that squat hold for two seconds. Feet wide, toes out. Find that squat, hold for one, hold for two, take it to the top. We've got the reverse lunge with the right leg back. You're gonna pulse for two. Step it in. Left leg goes back, find that lunge, pulse for two. Step it in. Come to a plank. Knees or toes, you've got two shoulder taps to each side. Bring it to the top. We have three of everything. Three push-ups, let's walk it out. Knees or toes, give me the three push-ups. After the push-up, lower it down. Find your Superman, pull the arms back to the W and then release. You've got three. Bring it to the top. We've got that sumo squat hold for a three count. Legs wide, toes out. Find that squat one, two, three. Take it to the top. Reverse lunge pulls for three on that right side. Step it in. Pulse, left side for three. Step it in. Take it back to that shoulder tap. Knees or toes. You'll tap the left hand to the right, right hand to left for three. Good, back to the top. We have four. We're gonna walk it out to a plank and take four push-ups. Knees or toes up to you. Lower it down. You've got four Supermans with that W pull with the arms. Release each time, lift and pull. Good. Bring it to the top. We've got that squat hold for four. Feet wide, toes out, lower down into your squat. We're holding for one, two, three, four. Take it up. Reverse lunge, right side pulse for four. Step it in. Reverse lunge on that left side, pulse for four. Great job, take it down to your plank. Knees or toes. We have shoulder taps for four. Tapping each side is one. Once you've got that, we start all the way at the top. Our longest round for five of everything. Walk it out to your plank. Knees or toes, you got five push ups. Lower down, you have five Superman W's. Lift, pull the arms back, reach the arms long and release. After that fifth one, Bring it to your feet. We have that sumo squat hold for five. Feet wide, toes out. Holding for five, four, three, two, one. We've got that reverse lunge pulse for five on the right. Reverse lunge pulse for five on the left. Good job, take it down. We have five shoulder taps.
After your five, bring it up. We're going down. We've got four of everything. Walk it out to your plank. Find those four push-ups. Lower it down, find those four Superman. Bring it up to the top. We have that squat hold for four, three, two, one. We've got the reverse lunge pulse for four. On the right and then the left. Four shoulder taps. We're on our way. Good. Back to the top. Three of everything. Walk it out to that plank. Give me three push ups. Three Superman. Bring it to the feet. We got that sumo squat, hold for three, two, one, step it in, reverse lunge pulse for three. We've got shoulder taps for three. We're almost there, we have two of everything. Walk it out, push ups for two. Lower down, Superman for two. Bring it up. Squat hold for two, one. Give me the two pulse in that reverse lunge on the right and then the left. Two shoulder taps. Nice job, guys. We have one of everything, and then we're going to stretch. Walk it out to your plank. Give me a push up. Lower down. Give me a Superman. Bring it up. Give me a sumo squat. Down and up. Give me a reverse lunge pulse on each side. We have one shoulder tap, and then we stretch. Nice job. Let's take it to a down dog from that shoulder tap. Press both heels to the mat and stretch out the calves and the hamstrings. Hips high. Push the chest close to the thighs. Nice job. Slowly lower to the knees. Tuck the toes and let's sit the hips to the heels. We're gonna stretch out those shoulders. We just put them through some work. Open up the arms to a T, press the heart forward, pull the arms back as far as you can. And then let the arms fall to the back, interlace the fingers, come to the knees, pull the palms and the forearms close together, pull the arms away from the body and stretch out those shoulders. Good. Bring the hands to the floor. Step the feet underneath you and fold. Tuck the chin and look behind you. Stretching out through the backs of the legs. And slowly roll to the top. We're going to step the left leg back. Even a slight bend in that front knee. Left leg stays long. We're gonna reach the left arm up and take a side bend to the right. Stretching out through the left side body through the left hip. Good, step it in. Step the left leg back. Right leg back, sorry. Right leg stays long. Slight bend in that left knee. Reach the right arm high. Side bend to the left. Stretching out through the right side body through that right hip. Good, step it to center. Let's reach the arms up overhead. Take a slight back bend. Let the arms slowly fall down to the side. You want to feel a stretch through the biceps. Do 
through the shoulders, through the chest. Good, let's interlace the fingers in the front. Push the palms out, round the spine and tuck the hips. Pull those shoulder blades apart. Nice job, let's bring that right arm across. One more shoulder stretch before we go. Gently pull that right arm across the body and stretch out the back side of that shoulder. Good, open it up. Other side, left arm in front, crosses the body. Find a stretch on the outside of that left shoulder. Good, let's take some shoulder rolls, big shoulder rolls, bending of the elbows, up, back, and down. Let's go forward. Nice job today, guys. 10 minutes of stretch, 10 minutes of cardio, and 10 minutes of strength. I hope I see you here next time. Mm -hmm.